Hi there, this is Dr. John Whitcomb talking about the one supplement Time Magazine says you should take. On the cover of Time Magazine a couple weeks ago, in this is May of 2018, is an article about longevity. And in there, there is a story about a company developing a product that might be the one pill everybody should be on. And what they're talking about is the NAD-NADH ratio. Now, what is NAD? Well, it's nicotinamide, which is basically the vitamin niacin. And, of course, we all need it. It is a vitamin. It is simply a combination of aspartic acid and tryptophan, but it makes a uh, two, uh, it makes a small uh, cofactor in protein synthesis that turns out to be critical in your mitochondria and the developing of energy. And NAD can basically pick up an electron and become NADH. So the ratio of NAD to NADH turns out to be the ratio of energy availability, the ability to generate energy out of fat or glucose. Now, here's the critical thing. When you're a young person, that ratio is about 700 to 1. And as we get older, it degrades. It becomes less, as much as 30 to 40 percent less. And there are those who maintain that all diseases are actually diseases of lack of energy. If your body had sufficient energy, it would be able to fight the disease. But as we get sick, one of the core things that happens is in many circumstances, we lose the ability to generate the NAD that allows us to make energy. So when you take NAD and terostilbene, as in the product talked about in Time Magazine, that's now a commercial supplement product developed at Harvard to much fanfare, you actually can show that you have a sustained amount of increased NAD in your body, and it stays elevated. And in the science article that they referred to, uh, adults were given a, either that pill or placebo or two pills. And depending on how much of the pill they were getting, they had measurable increases in their ratio back to normal. Now, the developers say that they don't get jet lag and they have lots of energy and they're just full of fizz and vinegar. But the measurement they measured was what's the NAD ratio in your blood. Now, here's where it gets really kinky. If you follow that logic, you can show that, in fact, you get the same effect when you get IV ozone. Now, ozone is a deadly poison in your lungs, and you hear about it all the time as we have to have ozone alerts during hot summer days. But when it gets mixed with your blood and infused back into you by many practitioners, of whom Dr. Schallenberger is the most prominent, you can show an equal increase in the NAD ratio. And now there are some very interesting things about how ozone might treat some infectious diseases, which probably needs to be studied further. I think it's very exciting. And there's some preliminary research about ozone helping cancer as well. Uh, certainly folks who'd get ozone IV like that feel more energetic. But it comes down to niacin and terostilbene, which is code word for blueberries. What will work for me? Well, I just had a bowl of blueberries, and uh, I have niacin. I haven't been taking it every day. I might just purchase this, this supplement that Time Magazine refers to and try it for a month and see if I feel better energy. If your energy is really in the, in the pits, you might try it too. But you're talking about the NAD-NAD ratio. We've known about this for years. Think about it. You might be hearing more. This might be the basis of many diseases. This is Dr. John Whitcomb talking about the one supplement Time Magazine says we all ought to take, tarot, stilbene, and NAD.